Sete Child Africa Initiative. Yeah, since I joined this uh, organization, I've seen it impact my life positively. I've grown spiritually. Of course, I have a lot to talk about the Pesetas. My name is Innocent Orishawa. I'm a student here at Chambogo University. Uh, Pesetas uh, is a group of young men and women whose focus, whose love, whose are drawn to, towards the love of Christ and uh, purpose to see change in this generation and the ones to come. When I had gone for an, a prime time fellowship with the Life Ministry and got to know the news about Pesetas, I was keen to know what they do. And uh, I joined Pesetas. Uh, Pesetas, ever since I joined the Pesetas, I've seen a lot of things happening, changing in my life. Spiritually, I've grown. I've learned to be interactive. I've learned how to share the messages. Yeah, I thank God for this great opportunity. And I know Pesetas is, this is just the beginning of everything. I have really loved the love around the fellowship with fairy youth. Uh, one among the key things is there are magazines where you come to share about spiritual growth. If you come and join and be part of this group, you'll be given a platform to share your faith, uh, to impact a life out there. Because there are so many people who need Christ and who needs a sense of direction. I really love these setters. I love being one. And really, I, I, I pray that really we shall move to greater heights. Thank you so much. My name is Henry Kizito. I'm a registered mail now. Hi, I am Douglas. And I'm Peter. I'm proud to be a member of Faith Setters Initiative for Africa. I joined Faith Setters in 2012. You're part of Faith Setters Initiative for Africa. It's a, a ministry that engages in ministry and uh, evangelism. One thing that has really kept me close with Faith Setters is uh, I want to be relevant to my community. And that is the central thing that keeps us as Faith Setters. We want to, to see improvement in different societal aspects. And we are not waiting for anybody to arouse us or for a general call. But we see that need and then we go for it and see lives being transformed. I believe the church has been called to be relevant in community. So faith setters really pushes us to go back and be relevant in community other than just sit and enjoy ministry in church, but also to be relevant Christians outside. So that's why I keep close with them. Yeah, I've been part of uh, faith setters for a month now and I've been impacted in a number of ways. And just like the name states, faith setters setting a pace. I've been a challenge to become an exemplar individual and to the youth. And we believe that God has called us to change nations, especially Africa, where there are so many challenges that is facing Africa. For example, we talk about diseases that are affecting our nations, talk of corruption, but we believe that the solution is Christ. Indeed, sure. indeed, indeed. And Christ being a solution, we look um, for ways of uh, forwarding Christ as the answer, as the solution, yeah. being uh, the role impact in Christianity <laughs> being the from forming the whole individual basis of what the youth lack because character is lacking and our youth have been challenged with the lack of purpose and lack of direction all which we can find in Christ because he creates I mean underlying foundation that is firm so if we are in Christ and the whole world is in Christ the youth the future leaders then there is hope for us and we still have a hope for this generation, however much it's fallen and all that, but we still believe that we are pointing this generation to Christ. And no matter what is happening, we believe the solution is Christ. So for everyone out there, come join us. Peseta is in Africa, pointing the generation to Christ. My name is Anne Bakanansa. I'm a math from graduate. I got to know Peseta in uh, 2011. And Pesetas initiative has really impacted me because it's running out for we the youth and not only us but the generation at large. Pesetas does a lot. It does corporate social responsibility like giving back to society. It has helped um, many children who have had their dream of going to school and have not been able to 
get the chance by their parents. Some of them have been helped out by their initiative. So it shows the love the team has for its uh, upcoming young people. Our generation is really facing a lot. We are facing a, a lot of immorality, a lot of uh, sexual abuse. But we believe as Perseter's initiative for Africa, we can come up as with the youth and together with other leaders and um, other people in society, we can come up to point our generation to the right way of living life. I joined Perseter's when I was not a born again. Uh, by then I was a Roman Catholic, but when I realized when I realized what these people do and when I got to speak and to interact, have a one-on-one -on -one with these other members, I realized that, that I had a lot, I was lacking God in my life and it has helped me get to that level. But most of all, believing in Christ and believing that our generation still has a lot to do for the society in terms of morals, in terms of economic and uh, social life. Hello, I'm Chris. Hello, my name is Alice Alele. Gillian uh, Bona. For the, for the short while I've known Pestetas, I've really been motivated. Pestetas has been part of my family now. I live Pestetas every day as part of my life. Every day I get to talk to the director, to the family members, my brothers and sisters. I just feel it's part of the family. And well, most of it is that I've been motivated. Uh, I've been, I've managed to bring out the talent I've had in me for a while. So currently, I do most of the writing. I basically advise on the Christian perspective. I bring out many highlights depending on the challenges we're having, the Christian view, the political view. So that has really helped me to grow spiritually and to grow in my writing as well. So I would encourage the youth out there to believe in what they have, to believe in the dream, that something that they look up to, to never give up. Basically, this is my first day with the setters and I'm really moved by the spirit of togetherness, the fellowship they have. I like the way they interact, the love they share. They are always willing to give and help where necessary. I've been moved in so many ways. And to be honest, I've, I'm really looking forward to so many other activities I'll have with my friends, with the first setters. Mm -hmm. I can't wait for so many other outreach programs to come. Today was my first day, and uh, what I'd like to focus on was for the first as a group is to go out to minister to the young people. What we'd really like is a generation of young people who, of, who grew up knowing God. That was uh, something that I wanted to pass on for uh, the setters to do for the young generation. My message to the youth out there is to get involved. There's a lot we can do, but most times you're not aware. Get involved. It could be a community next to you, at home, church, a cell, maybe a group that comes together with a common vision of group or goal. Mm. So please get involved. Reach out to those in need. Reach out to those that need your help. Because if you're blessed with your arms, you have your legs, you have the energy to do something, get out there and do something. Do not only concentrate in um, maybe doing fun activities, clubbing and all that. Get involved in so many other activities you can do that are helpful to those around you. Okay. One, two, three, let's go. What's up, people of God? Um, my name is Aaron and I'm from Uganda. I am a part of Pesetas Initiative for Africa. We are a group of individuals that have stood out because of what we see happening in our generation. Have you ever woken up one morning and probably felt like you should not have woken up that morning? Have you ever been a part of a society that has neglected you? Have you ever been part of a group of people that have said that probably you are that kind of person that can never make it in life? Well, we are here.
Faith Status Initiative for Africa to let you know that there is hope in Jesus Christ, there is hope in trusting in God, there is hope in believing that there is a better uh, day that is coming ahead. Many of us do weep, many of us neglect ourselves, many of us let go of our dreams, but as Faith Status Initiative for Africa, we are here to let you know that you can stand out, you can be proud, you can get your esteem back, and you can believe in God for something that is far much greater. What more do I have to tell you? We have something that is big, something that is so great and that is the writer's ministry we are a ministry of writers as well we are here to inspire writing within you you've had it uh, whereby we've had media coming in we have quite a number of press media uh, houses in uganda but most of them have brought out material that has neglected you probably in a way that has impacted you in a negative manner but what we have this time as writers ministry is to bring up something that is so much better so if you want to be a part of us it is very easy just go to our blog page it is first status initiative dot wordpress.com you can as well call us we have our uh, numbers running on your screen you can as well uh, email us on our email is pestators initiative uh, pestators21 at gmail.com otherwise it is always a blessing you can be a part of us from all angles we are in every single university we are in every single fellowship we are everywhere in the country simply get in touch with us and be a part of what we are doing otherwise god bless you so much we'll keep in touch